Hello and welcome back to the RetroTech Retreat with Mr H. We've been spending a fair bit of time on this little Pi R33. We've had the chassis in and out a few times now and I suppose inevitably we had a slight slip and damaged the speaker. I caught the speaker cone and made a small hole in it. Duffy, let's go to work. So let's have a look at a repair of the paper cone of a very old speaker. Hopefully you can see the tear. It's slightly complex. There's several branches off it. If we don't stabilize it, it's likely to cause distortion in the speaker, uh, particularly at higher volumes. It will also only get worse with use. This simple repair requires a small patch of tissue and some straightforward PVA adhesive. First, using a brush, apply the PVA to the tissue, getting plenty on it right to the edges. Then carefully pick up the tissue and place it over the area of the tear, taking care not to push too hard against the comb. Once it's in place, then start applying more PVA adhesive on top of the tissue, gently holding it in place to build up some PVA on top of it, avoiding curling the edges under. Eventually it will stick and then we can just build up some more PVA adhesive on top to firm up the tissue on the repair. So just keep building up a little bit of PVA, make sure the tissue is well soaked with it and it's moulded to the profile of the speaker. Then just put it aside for a couple of hours for the PVA to cure. So here we are a couple of hours later and the PVA is fully cured and it looks like it's adhered very well to the paper cone. Just a gentle tap shows that it's now more or less integral with the cone and so I'm confident that we've stabilised the bad tear in that cone and it should work okay. So what we're going to do now is reinstall the speaker into the radio and give it a quick test. Okay so that's the repair done and we've got the speaker reinstalled into the radio so now what we're going to do is switch her on and see if we can detect any deterioration of uh, performance of the speaker let's see as ever takes a little bit to warm up because of the uh, valves here she goes I'm texting every day, Cristiano, to come to Lille, so... <laughs> Have you had a reply to those texts from Cristiano? Just a ha-ha-ha. <laughs> so, I mean, how do you feel about it, in, in all honesty, Josie? I know how tough it was for Lille to, to win... Sounds pretty good to me. So that's it. Seems to have worked. I think we'll chalk that one up as a successful repair. So, like and subscribe if you enjoyed this episode. Leave a comment if you like. You know how to do that here. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye for now. Good job, Duffy. Let's go for tea.